So I decided to set this up on the, the light colored coffee table so it's easier to see the pieces in that instead of putting it on the actual board and, and that which uh, then they'll just blend in and kind of disappear. So these are the, the pieces, these pieces here, these are the ones that I'm going to do on my tutorial. I've shown them uh, the other day and uh, if you caught that, that video, so I'm going to um, be working on these. But first I thought I'd just lay out all the pieces and, and show you what I got because I kind of want to get into and explain, you know, when it, you know, I kind of like to explain how I come about doing these things and not just, you know, here's the product, here's the material and do it, you know, so I'd rather explain, you know, what, um, you know, the size of pieces and, and that. So, so for example, like this is my, my biggest piece on here. This is probably about like 16 by 16 inches around about. Um, then I got these smaller guys. These ones are probably roughly about maybe eight by eight inches. And then I got all my little plants, which I've shown before. And these are actually mounted on pennies, but I find they're a little bit tippy, so when you go to put them down, like to be easy, they could easily get knocked down. So uh, let's see what I got here. I've I'll probably show most of the stuff here, so I'll just kind of do a little flyover on some of the pieces that I got. Yeah, I've shown most of these before. Plants. These, a lot of these plants are um, you know plastic plants. Some of them are. Um, you know, from uh, fish store, or the, like these come from an aquarium. These ones, I think. Uh, these ones, these tall ones, I think, are from the dollar store. Some of these other ones are a lot of them are from the dollar store. Some of the nicer ones are actually from the silk warehouse. But I try to buy anything that, first of all, it's got to look good, and then second of all, you know, um, you know, it can't be too overly priced. But anyways, so that's uh, so that's some of the pieces that I got going on here. Let's come over here. Here's some elephant grass pieces that I'm working on, that I've done, I should say. Alright, I've shown you that piece before, my, my palm tree. So, what I like to do is, when I'm designing a board, first of all, <coughs> I like to have my real big pieces. So, this one here, this is my, my big ones, and this one here. So, once you've got your board built, and you try to keep your board, your board or your table, I should say, try to keep it more on the basic side is what I like to do myself. And then I like to put on bigger pieces so that way I can move stuff around and customize them. Then once I've got a couple big pieces like these, like this one and this one, then what I'll do is then I'll build all these little, all these little ones. That way I can always move them, you know, push them together, uh, add them, remove as I need. And then that way you can make your your table more, um, you can customize it a lot better. Then uh, I make my even smaller pieces. So like this one here. So in relation, you know, to my hand, you know, it's not very big. But with these small ones, with all these little guys, now I can easily go over and I can put them on my, my bigger board with all these little guys if I want more foliage on there. So, and you know, you can go as crazy as you want. You can remove them, you can add guys, uh, and whatever you need. 